arrive from Chicago. Passengers may be Hey, Gilmore! Mom! cameras everywhere that caught the very graceful moment on tape. I'm so glad to see you. No, I'm glad to see you. I'm never leaving home again. Oh, that's my emotionally stunted girl. Hey, I got you gifts. What? I'm the one that left town. I'm supposed to get you gifts. Oh, uh, but I got here early and there was nothing to do except feed gummy bears to the bomb-sniffing dogs, which <laughs> apparently the United States government frowns upon. You got in trouble with the government while you were waiting for me? Just a little. How much is a little? Learn Russian. Okay, here you go. Wow, a Hartford, Connecticut sweatshirt. Nice, huh? Hartford, Connecticut notebook. Hartford, Connecticut pencil set. Hartford, Connecticut shot glass. And beer mug. Hartford baguette. Hartford bear. Hartford sunglasses. You like? I love. All right, let's go. We'll get your bags and we'll hit the road. And then I can't wait to hear all about Washington. And by the way, I got you out of dinner with the Gilmores tonight. I thought you and Dean might enjoy a little peaches and herb time together. Oh, thanks. What'd you tell them? That you get home tomorrow. Big fat lie. Yes, which proves how much I love you. The fact that I was willing to lie to my own parents, who I never lied to, just so you could have a night of happiness, is proof positive of my deep, undying devotion that I have for you. I appreciate that. And all that devotion can be yours for the low, low price of $29.95. Forget it. Okay, I'll throw in a set of steak knives. My bags, please. Are you telling me that you want this gesture of love for free? What kind of world are you living in? 